Ivan with Country Fishing YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to how to tie a catfish rig. It's called the Zero Rig. It's really close to the Santee Rig, but uh, minus the barrel swivel. <coughs> what you'll have, you'll have a flat no roll sinker. I use a three ounce because I fish in heavy current at a dam. Beveled side towards your rod. This is your main line. Slide it through like that. Get your uh, get you a bead. You can use a rubber bead or a, I use hard plastic beads. Slide that on. And what you're gonna do? Pull you some main line up, make you a loop. We're going to tie a polymer knot. I use 8 dot circle hooks. These are from Team Catfish. Doesn't really matter though. I use all types of brands. I'm not a, I'm not one to get stuck on brands. And we'll make a loop. Push another. Push your this loop back here through this loop. Run your hook through the loop. Wet it. Pull it taut. Clip off the excess. And this is called the Zero Rig. What you will have is your bait. If you pull your your main line, if you pull it taunt, your bait will be zero. It will be on the bottom. Fish picks this up. He runs with it. He never feels. He never feels the weight. Even if he's off to the side, he's not going to feel it. That'll give you the chance, if you're using a circle hook, I use it. I use a circle hook. If you use a J hook or whatever, you know, you can set the, set the hook if you want. I set my bait clicker, and when the fish grabs the bait, and he gets it in his mouth, and he starts leaving with it, my reel will start clicking. Well, instead of snatching the line like a lot of guys do to set the hook with this circle hook, all I have to do is shut my bait clicker off and start reeling. And when I reel, this turns this hook into his mouth, and it'll it'll get him in the corner every time. All right, guys, this is the zero, what they call the zero rig for catfishing. Hope somebody gets uh, get some use out of this rig here. I don't use this all the time because where I fish, we have a lot of debris on the bottom. So I, I think you know, uh, I think my bait gets down in that debris and, and away from the fish. I usually tie the Santee rig to where I'll have a, a 17 to, to 24 inch leader hanging off of here with a barrel swivel. That way my bait can get up here and move around in the water, but uh, in certain applications this works great, works awesome. Uh, hope somebody gets some use out of it. I'll make a few more videos here of some different rigs. Uh, if you like the video, please like, please hit the like button. Uh, subscribe to my channel for more videos coming up. Uh, I've got a lot more to share, I've got a lot more fishing uh, fishing to do, fishing videos to make, so, alright guys, thanks for watching my video, y'all take care, tight lines.